Hello everybody! Welcome back to my channel. It's me again, a Keratul Janat, your service. Today we are going to make banana cake with nuts and peanut butter. First of all, I'm going to introduce to you all the ingredients. Anyway, I'm going to write at the description below all the ingredients that I am going to use, but uh, I'm going to show you the ingredients I'm going to. This is the very ripe banana. And this is an egg uh, replacer because I don't have eggs. I'm too lazy to go outside to buy some eggs. So I'm using this kind of uh, egg uh, replacer. It's a vegan egg replacer with organic chai. Here is the Here is the ingredients and here is how you make if you're going if you're using an egg replacer in the back there is a, um what's that one uh, instruction how to make it and uh, I'm going to use uh, flour of course the fl this one is uh, Nandayari coffee creamer, but I'm, I put flour in it inside. I'm going to use flour. The normal flour. And this is the nuts that I'm going to use. Any kind of nuts you can. Sugar. And uh, here is the um, vanilla powder because I don't have vanilla extract. Here is the baking soda, here is the baking uh, powder, and here is the cinnamon. And uh, instead of I'm um, if instead of for me using vegetable oils, vegetable oil, I'm going to use olive oil, or you can use also um, what is that one? You can use also um, any kind of oil. Coconut oil is very good vegetable oil or uh, butter margarine whatever kind of oil you want and of course I'm going to put also salt there's already in the middle of there here is the peanut butter here I'm using this kind of peanut butter whatever kind of peanut butter you use it's okay you can also use the chunky peanut butter so you don't need to put any nuts on it or mix it's uh, okay and uh, here is a cup of yogurt or uh, you can use uh, what what is that one there is another uh, another terms of uh, i forgot about that one but i'm using yogurt and uh, yeah that's all that's all I'm going to use. So let's get started. Let's do the banana first. Bismillah. It's very ripe banana. It's very good to make a cake or uh, banana cake or banana bread. Or uh, sometimes uh, I threw, I put in the freezer a banana. If it's too much, I buy and I couldn't eat them all. I put in the freezer. You can use a frozen banana also. You need to make sure that it's ripe also before you put in the freezer. Because uh, as, as the expert said, the banana have a peel like this color is the best. Because it's, uh, I don't know, that's what they said. It's lots of uh, vitamins and you know, it's good to eat your body. like uh, a cup one cup or one and a half cup of banana everything i will write at the description below so you can just check it out Mm-hmm. 
Now we're going to mix the eggs, uh, egg replacer. much better in here see I'm going to mix the sugar with the wet ingredients and uh, half cup of uh, olive oil and uh, a cup of yogurt And of course, the peanut butter. And the lastly is the nuts after we mix everything. Coconut oil is very good also, it's so healthy to put with the cake. If you want your, uh, if you want this one to be uh, very sweet, you can mix honey with the sugar or you can put uh, another half cup more of sugar. But I don't like with my cake, I always reduce the sugar. Because I don't, I don't like it very sweet. So our wet ingredient is uh, done. So we will do the dry ingredients. Now we do. We put we put the flour on it. Bismillah. Three cups of flour. Okay, three cups of flour. And we will mix the this one, the cinnamon baking soda, uh, bake, uh, baking powder and baking uh, uh, vanilla powder and baking soda and salt mix in here and then after that we will mix the wet ingredients the banana mixture and then in the last we will put the nuts I like nuts also you can with the banana you can mix uh, <coughs> carrots Okay, there you go. It mixed. Let's mix the banana mixture uh, gradually. We mix this one first and then we will 
mix it again. The peanut butter is still, and you can also beat this one with the electric uh, mixer. It's okay. It's up to you. But I'm not going to do that. I'll just mix it with my hand. Last, last, last. The mixture is done. The thing and the only thing is we will just mix the nuts. Half cup of nuts or a cup of nuts. It depends on how much you like to put the nuts. It's optional. Do you want to put nuts? It's okay. If you don't want, it's okay also. I'm going to put the uh, one fourth. And There you go. Let's just uh, prepare the baking pan. Okay, here is the baking pan I'm going to use. So we're going to put the batter in there. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim been a while I didn't bake and you know there you go let's put this one in the oven for like uh, 30 to 45 minutes or until the toothpick will come out clean thank you so much just set this aside for uh, a little while until the oven will be will be warm okay the cake is ready guys it's uh, ready for the test test there you go guys Let's taste it. How it goes. Okay. Let's do the taste test, guys. Bismillah. I like the edge. So, we will do the edge. Okay, I don't want to 
damage my Sila. Wow. See that? Oh. Sila. Oh. Here. Look. Look at that. Sila Rahman Rahim. Let's taste it. How it tastes. See that? Mmm, that's good. Not so sweet. Wow, yummy. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you like my video. I will uh, absolutely write at the description below how. Uh, about the recipe the exact amount of the recipe let's uh, put it in the middle and we'll see thank you guys for watching and I hope you like my video and if you do please um, please share and write write at the comment below how you how we could improve this recipe and write at the comment below what do you think see it's so yummy it's need to be a uh, mm. it's so good Thank you so much guys for watching. I hope you like my video. Please, uh, if you are not yet subscribed to my channel, please kindly uh, press the subscribe button and uh, don't forget the notification bell so you are all updated to all my videos. Thank you so much. I love you guys. Bye-bye.